Hi everyone, Aiden here with eTrailer. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at and showing you how to install these clip-on universal towing mirrors from K-Source on our 2023 Chevrolet Tahoe. So right away, a towing mirror is gonna be really useful for enhancing your field of view when you are towing a trailer. After all, this is very large behind us and it is gonna limit our view. Right now I'm here in the factory mirror and as I walk over to the left, you'll see me disappear from the factory mirror and appear over in the towing mirror. So what this does is adds a little bit of field of view, makes it a lot easier to see into our blind spot and make us more confident going down the road when we are switching lanes or making turns. So the things I really like about this mirror is the fact that it's so large. This gives us a great area to view everything and it makes it a lot easier to see things because it's just a larger mirror surface. It is a convex mirror, which maybe isn't the best for a realistic reflection. It is going to distort things a bit, but it also gives us a wider field of view with this mirror. So compared to a flat mirror of the same size, we will be able to see more. It just might not be as accurate when you're trying to judge the distance of those things. As far as adjustment goes, you've got tons of room to move things side to side, up and down, as well as fully rotate it so that it's in a more landscape mode. Now I will say this is very stiff and hard to move, but that's a really great thing because if you know you want it in this horizontal view to give you even wider field of view, you know it's not gonna be moving around and shifting on you when you're going down the road. The clips will hold on to the inside of the mirror housing on your factory mirror, and they get a pretty good hold on there. They're pretty large clips, and what I really like is that the straps actually pull those clips tight. So on a lot of the mirrors we've tested today, we've had a gap on this top right clip just because of the shape of the mirror housing. But with this one, it pulls it tight. So everything here is really snug with no gaps or movement, resulting in a much stronger fit than the other universal mirrors we've worked with. The other thing that helps make this so secure is the fact that rather than just a rubber strap around the back, it's a ratcheting mechanism. So we can get a really strong hold on these straps with the mechanism to tighten it. There's a thick rubber pad on the back to make sure that your mirror is protected, but then we still have that strong hold on the actual towing mirror. With this, it's not going to interfere with your mirror's ability to actually fold inward like this. So if we are driving somewhere, pull into a parking space and we need a little extra room, we can fold this in. We don't have to remove the mirror and reinstall it whenever we get back on the road. Just fold it back out and you're ready to go. This does come in a kit of one or two, and whichever one you go with, they're gonna install the exact same way. You just get more with the kit of two so you can have both sides have the towing mirrors. They're really easy to install too, so let's check out how we did it. To start the install, you just wanna take the mirror and get the arms flexed out. There's two points of movement right here behind the mirror and on the arms themselves. So this is gonna give us the fit over our factory mirror with these clips sitting right inside the lip of the factory mirror. So I'm just gonna get it loosely set up in place and kind of see about where it's gonna sit, kind of move some things around, find out where I want it, maybe move it up and down if I think it would fit better there. And now I can take my straps. As far as the strap goes, there's a pad right in the middle. I'm gonna have it with a thick part of the pad face down, and I'm gonna hook that top hook on the strap that's feeding out of our mirror right there. Kind of change my grip up and open this lever to reveal the actual mechanism that will loosen this strap. Just pressing the button right there, feeding it down the mirror housing. Right there, it's looking pretty good, like it's gonna fit really well. I'm actually going to maybe go down just a little bit more. And then this bottom part is stretchy. So what I'm gonna do is probably loosen that up a fair bit and stretch it to reach the hook location on the bottom of the mirror. So I'll just stretch that over to hook it in place. And as I do, just make sure that everything on the actual mirror housing is still staying in place. And then we can repeat that process on the other side. Once everything is loosely in place and we make sure that our clips are still on the lip of the mirror, we can take this inner lever and lift that up like a ratcheting mechanism to actually secure these straps on the mirror. I'm just gonna kinda go back and forth so I tighten them relatively evenly with each other, but this will get a good strong hold on the factory housing for our towing mirror. 
once you're happy with how tight everything is, you can just flip these little latch covers down. And I always like to kind of shake it around and make sure that none of the contact points are coming loose and that the actual towing mirror feels really solid on the factory mirror, which it does. So at this point, if you've got the kit of two, you can install the other side and then you're ready to hit the road. That'll do it for our look at these K-Source universal clip-on towing mirrors on the 2023 Chevy Tahoe. Thanks for watching.